Hello friends, friends, there are three types of astrology in India. The first one is Parashari, the second one is Nadi Jyotish by Rishi Bragu, and the third one is Gemini astrology. So you can understand the basic concept of astrology is to predict the events. Okay, so for the prediction, we need coordinates, and with the help of coordinates or numbers, we can predict the probable and possible event. As far as Gemini astrology is concerned, it is not practiced in India very much today, and uh, it is also not predictive because of the concepts used in Gemini is totally different from the Parashari Jyotish and Gemini uh, and the Bhragu Nadi Jyotish. Okay, uh, one thing should also be noted that in South India, uh, there is a practice of uh, Nadi leaves. So Nadi leaves are entirely different from the Bhragu Jyotish of Nadi Jyotish as we use these terms interchangeably uh, the palm leaves of uh, Nadi system in South India is the product of Agastya Rishi Agastya Rishi got this knowledge from Lord Shiva and Parvati okay and uh, Bhragu Rishi work is different from the work of Rishi Agastya so please note that and uh, as far as uh, Nadi Jyotish of Bhragu Rishi is concerned, we use Nakshatra and uh, Sub Sub Lord or you can say Up Nakshatra system. Okay, so we have a lot of coordinates and with the help of coordinates, we will try to predict the future. And as far as uh, Parashari astrology, Parashari astrology is most practiced in all over the India and uh, as compared to the Nadi Jyotish, Parashari astrology is very famous also. But if you see the predictive aspect, Bhragu Rishi work is more precise and more uh, easy to understand and to implement as compared to the Parashari Jyotish. So please note that. So these are the three systems plus palm leaves of Agast Rishi. Okay. So it is very important and uh, after uh, analysis of uh, any horoscope we can predict the future events with the help of Bhragu Rishi Nadi Jyotish. So if you have any query you can ping me. Thank you.